Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to our Tuesday. I'm not sure what day it'll be for you when you watch this. I don't know what day it's going to go up, and I don't even know if you're going to watch it on the day it goes up. So happy whatever day it is for you. I hope you have a very fabulous day. I'm getting ready to make some blueberry muffins, and then I'm going to possibly take a shower and then work on breakfast. So this is kind of like a midday, mid-morning snack. Um, Ashlyn likes to call it second breakfast. <laughs> so I just want to go ahead and get these done in baking before I get into anything else because this is going to take the longest amount of time, I think. So as long as these are taken care of and we can just snack on them after breakfast, um, I just, like I said, I just want to have this taken care of. It's going to make it easier. So we're going to do this first. So I'm going to make blueberry muffins. Like I said, I just have this chocolate chip muffin recipe that I always use. Um, but I'm just going to substitute blueberries instead of chocolate chips. So, uh, we're going to go ahead and get our dry ingredients going in here. I have the oven preheating to 400 right now. We're going to do two cups of flour. And let me just tell you, if when you see my face and you think I look tired, just know I am very tired. The past three nights have not been going well for sleep. Half a cup of sugar. I am quite exhausted. I'm gonna add some freeze dried carrot powder, hemp seed, flax seed. These are not in the recipe. And I'm also going to add some vanilla protein powder right here. This, if you can see it. Okay, now half a teaspoon of salt. Um, let's add a sprinkle of cinnamon, just because. That's not in the recipe either, but why not? I was just trying to get my video edited from yesterday where I was making... What was I even making? I don't even remember, bread, some kind of bread, cinnamon applesauce bread. And I was saying baking powder and baking soda and I was looking at my hand and I said them completely backwards. But anyway, three teaspoons of baking powder. And yes, I'm saying that correctly today. I did the measurements correct yesterday, I believe. I don't even know anymore, who knows? I'm, like I said, I need some actual decent sleep. Oh man, it's been a rough three nights y'all, but it's okay. It'll get better. So we're gonna mix all this around and then we're gonna add our blueberries and toss them in these, this flour real quick. Okay, now we're gonna add three quarters of a cup of milk. Yeah, three quarters of a cup of milk. A third a cup of vegetable oil. I'm using avocado oil. And one egg. So I'm gonna add the tiniest little bit of water just for the freeze dried carrots so it doesn't soak up all the moisture. Sometimes I do and sometimes I don't. Honestly, I just look at the texture of how things are mixing together, um, which isn't always an indicator because it can take time to soak it up. But if things already look a little bit dry, I'll add a little bit of water. If things don't look dry at all, like yesterday, I didn't add anything extra to the applesauce bread because it was like wet enough. Um, I don't know, there's really no, I'm sure there are plenty of ways to tell what needs extra and what doesn't. But so far, what I do has been working fine. So that's just what I do. So we bake these at 400 for 20 to 25 minutes.
serve some second breakfast. We have our blueberry muffins, oranges, and some cut up grapes there. And while everybody eats and snacks, I'm gonna go ahead and start reading our Bible and get some lessons, our group subjects done while we're all here eating. So I think they liked having a little second breakfast here. Did you guys, en yeah. did you guys enjoy that? Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. Well, that was like weird in my phone. I don't know if that just was to you guys, the light coming in. Anyway, um, we are in the middle of school. We are kind of switching things around today, doing some group subjects first and individual stuff later and just all over the place today. Um, it's just been a very weird day for, I'm tired. I'm just tired and the focus is just not there. I'm just like, ugh. I almost thought about taking our break today and then doing school Friday, which normally I think any other week I would do, but my parents are coming. Um, Thursday night, well, Thursday evening, they'll be here. And so I want to have Friday off. So we're not trying to get it all done while they're here. So we're not going to skip today. We're just going to power on through. So the kids were loving their first breakfast and their second breakfast. Um, they pretty much polished off everything. I think when I just got up, there was one muffin left. So, um, they're doing really well with that. And I think as long as I can continue that, I'm going to do that because it helps keep them focused at the table and they're just like sitting there snacking and brain power food as they're doing school. So um, we're gonna try to keep it going, but if we don't, then that's okay. Um, for lunch today, we're gonna do leftover spaghetti. I made sure I'd made extra yesterday so we would have enough to have for today. So we'll do that at some point. Um, and then for dinner tonight, the plan is chicken enchiladas, but yes. we shall see. Yes, um, Ashlyn said yes. So that is the plan, um, maybe either a salad or rice and beans. I need to figure out what. I have a thinking rice and beans, but I think I might just throw together a salad to go with it instead. Um, but I'll worry about that later. I already pulled out, I have shredded chicken, cooked shredded chicken ready to go. So that part's easy. Um, and then all I gotta do is wrap them up and make the cheese sauce and pop them on in the oven. So dinner will be very, very easy tonight. But I'm gonna go sit back down and get some more schoolwork done with the kids. And then when it's lunchtime, I'll share lunch with you. So right now I am in the process of getting some lunch heated up. So we have some leftover noodles, leftover meatballs and sauce. And then these are Layla's noodles that I kept separate for her um, because I pulled hers out last night and added butter. Um, I pulled hers out for dinner and then pulled some extra out for her. And then I added butter and mixed it into everybody else's. So I cannot get this open. I, I, no, I, can't. Cause I didn't unclip the other side. Um, and then I'm also going to make Gary some to take to work tomorrow for his lunch. Um, so I'm going to heat up some plates, but right now it's just Layla Wilder and myself that want some. The girls don't want any yet because they ate quite a few muffins. So they're not quite ready for lunch. So earlier I made Gary, um, some breakfast for lunch tomorrow. He made some corned beef hash this weekend. I don't think I, it was a day I didn't film. And then I made him two eggs and gave him some sausage and he has bread at work. So that'll be his breakfast. And then now he also has some lunch to take. Easy lunch today. I'm just leftovers. So while we wait for art class, which is really soon, we're just going through our history book and I'm trying to read them a little bit of it, but we'll have to finish it up after art class today. Okay, kids are doing art class right now. And I decided I'm using my scissors. Today they made Easter eggs. So it's not often that I share snacks on here. But I do share with you guys every other thing. So let me know if you want me to share snacks too. So right now, everybody's having some chips and salsa with some grapes as a snack. It's time to work on some dinner. So the first thing I'm gonna do is shred this Monterey Jack cheese. And normally I use more than this, but this is all I have. So I'm gonna have to make this work. So I'm gonna put this in here. I'm gonna use this to shred up my chicken a little bit more too. I'm gonna put a full stick of butter in. make some cheese sauce. This is gonna be our enchilada topping. Some sour cream. And two cans of green chilies. So I'm just gonna let this melt down and if it's not cheesy enough, I'm just gonna add this um, Mexican rice. Won't be straight white queso, but that's okay. You just gotta do what you gotta do and make do with what you have. So I'm gonna let this melt. I should throw this chicken up some more just so it's a lot finer than it is. 
So I don't ever do this, but I'm gonna add a little bit of this salsa. So I got this and it was two jars and we don't really like it. Um, so I wanna kinda use it, but sparingly in here. That way it's using up the salsa, but we don't have to eat it as salsa. I just heated this up so it was nice and warm. All right, so now I'm just going to stuff and roll. They're going outside to take care of animals. I'm going to take care of food. So I did end up adding a little bit of the Fiesta or Mexican cheese. I'm not sure what it is. And I'm just going to pour these over and I'm going to put these in on 350 for about 30 minutes. So I did heat up the chicken. I don't, I think I said I heated up the chicken with the salsa in the microwave just so it was nice and warm on the inside too. So we just cut up some toppings for a salad, but also for um, the enchiladas. It can go on both. So that's done. I got out dates and pumpkin seeds if anybody wants those in their salad, some sour cream, and I'm just waiting on the enchiladas to be done. Here are our chicken enchiladas. What's funny is I never really feel like eating this, but every time I make it and we eat it, everybody's always like, my gosh, I'm so glad you made it. And me too. I don't know why. It's one of those meals I'm just like, I'm never looking forward to. But then after eating it, I love it. I don't know why. Like, I don't understand why I'm like that, but it's just every single time. I'm like, eh. I almost thought about not making it today. Even after I had planned on it, even after I had the meat thawed, I was like, I just don't feel like it. But now that I've done it, I know I'm gonna love it. So here's our dinner tonight, our chicken enchiladas and some salad. So I'm standing in my usual spot to tell you that our video is over. I don't know, I don't ever plan it. This is just what I do. I don't know how else to finish a video because I don't do much after dinner. Honestly, we clean up dinner. We have a chore system where everybody has their specific chore for the night. And then, so we all help clean up. We all take care of animals. Usually we do that before dinner. Sometimes it's after dinner. Um, but then after we have kiddos that we've got to get changed into pajamas or showered or bathed or just whatever. And there's nothing left for me to film because yeah. So it's the end of the day. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you tomorrow with a new video of who knows what. I have no idea what I'm going to make for breakfast, for lunch, nothing. I don't know, but I'll see you then.